Welcome to the Journey of Love and Light. Libra, this is your May general reading. It may or may not resonate with everyone. Take what resonates and leave the rest. Never give a reader your power. I've already meditated over these cards and shuffled these cards, um, but give them a few more shuffles before we get started uh, with your May reading. I hope all is going well in your world. Here we go. Spirit, show me clearly the messages that Libra needs to see. Mess that ne Libra needs to see. Please, Spirit, show me clearly what messages does Libra need to see. Spirit, show me clearly what messages does Libra need to see. What messages? My goodness, Spirit wants to talk to you. What messages does Spirit need to see? All right, I think we've got your reading out here. Let's pull these cards. Here we go. All right, Libra, let's get rolling. First card out is the wheel in the upright position. It says things are going to be moving forward, um, possibly very swiftly, um, related to a ace of pentacles, a new financial beginning. The two of pentacles says that you are maybe juggling a situation or you have a choice. The king of swords um, says that um, you know you have a clear perspective on the future and what it is that you want to achieve. The seven of wands in reverse says that you know you may have felt like that you had you needed to um, defend your defend a situation or hold your boundaries, but uh, what I'm sensing is that that's not necessary um, in in the current environment or the current energy. The page of swords in reverse. The Nine of Pentacles in the upright. So here's the Pentacle, and here's the Nine of Pentacles. There's your Ten Pentacles right there, your Ten Pens. The Temperance card says, you know, got to have some patience. Um, the Three of Pentacles, you know, working at the situation and uh, rounding it out with the Eight of Wands. Um, so we have a Seven and an Eight. So there's definitely progression in this reading. So, Spirit, let me take a moment here and look at this reading. So, Libra. What I'm sensing is that, you know, as we're coming into the month of May for you, there is going to be some changes happening with regard to your financial situation. There is a new opportunity coming in, perhaps you a new job offer, a new um, a business uh, potential, new side hustle happening. Um, but you, it's going to require that you need to make a decision about it. Like which which of these different things that you're doing that's making money that you need to be focusing on because you the juggling uh, back and forth is preventing you from making um, as much forward progress as you possibly could make if you um, stay focused on one area or another. And the, the King of Swords is here to help bring that focus, to help you get that clarity, to cut away any, um, you know, uh, things that were preventing you from being able to to make those choices uh, ahead. And, you know, again, this King of Swords gives you the confidence. This this is, you know, also air energy, Libra, your air sign. Um, this could be your, your energy here. But this um, Seven of Wands in, in reverse says that, you know, you may, like I said, you may have felt like that you needed to defend something or your boundaries or your situation. Situation. But what I'm sensing is that that's not really necessary and there's going to be some um, a new information coming in to confirm that, that there's there's nothing to worry about. Um, the uh, Page of Swords in reverse says that, um, you know, perhaps this message has been delayed, you know, the message that you've been waiting for as it relates to, you know, potentially, uh, you know, building this coin. But definitely you're going to be in a position where you are, um, you know, financially um, uh, well is well off you know you have you have enough coins you have you know um, the money uh, saved away but it's going to take some time to get there it's not going to happen overnight and it's going to take some work so know and Libra that you know you have a bright future ahead of you as it relates to your financial situation your financial concerns but not you know Rome wasn't built in a day and you won't be able to build up your bank overnight so spirit show me clearly give me advice for Libra as it relates to this message, Spirit, show me clearly. Advice for Libra that relates to this message. Okay, here we go. Um, the Page of Pentacles and the Page of Wands. Okay, so you have a lot of pages here. You have a lot of young energy in this situation and a lot of potential um, uh, 
new offers, new opportunities, new things that are coming around. Um, but this, what I'm sensing is that the, the whoever's bringing you a, a financial offer, a situation that is going to uh, bring you potentially um, more money, that is the offer that you need to be focusing on because the offer that is you know, um, coming in from maybe a younger energy that seems a little bit flighty, it, you know, universe is telling you to be, to be wary of that inner, that energy and stay, instead of, you know, going for the immediate uh, gratification, you know, uh, wait around for the, um, uh, longer term win, but they will ultimately, um, be more solid and it would be to stay. So here's those offers that, you know, those two choices that you have to make, you know, take the choice that is, is the more solid offer that's going to lead to your, you know, financial well-being. Don't go with the offer that just seems a, a little bit, um, you know, too good to be true is what I'm hearing here. So is there anything else for Libra as we close out this reading? Yeah, so the two of cups says that, you know, again, here's the two, the two, the choice here, the two of cups here it says, you know, again, this, there's a choice that has to be made here. Um, and uh, the uh, underlying energy, the bottom of the deck is the ten of pentacles. So that tells me that, you know, here, remember here we had the ten of pentacles here. This is a confirmation. So the universe is saying, I said what I said, that the uh, potential for uh, financial wealth and well-being is here. Um, you just have to have patience um, as it relates to situations stay focused because there will be something to celebrate um, and it could be um, a, a, a as a family situation there could be some sort of a party could be a, a wedding an engagement you know something that solidifies the family situation as it also helps with um, uh, generating this um, legacy wealth I hope that this was useful to you, and if it was, please like, um, uh, smash the like button, and subscribe to my channel so that I can share my readings with you and other people in the future. Much appreciated. Peace and blessings on your journey.